So here's my first prototype of the laser corkscrew screen. This design is very crude, but it's a very simple concept. Lasers pointed through the spinning corkscrew draw scan lines as it spins. Custom making the semi-translucent corkscrew is probably the hardest part. In the end, I first made the corkscrew out of paper and attached it to the chopstick. Then I solidified it with layer after layer of superglue. The array of lasers was first aligned and attached to a chopstick using first modeler's glue, then super glue, then hot glue. There's a spider web of wire supporting the other end of the axle. Now, this is because I didn't have the proper parts or bearings or anything. Um, it's relatively thin and smooth, so it provides a very low friction point on the other side. There is a single laser separate from the array that acts as a sensor. It's pointed through the corkscrew so that it occasionally penetrates a gap between the end and start of the corkscrew. This creates a pulsing signal in the infrared sensor on the other side. The frequency is a little low on this system, so it's a bit of a pain in the butt to film. If you pay attention or pause the video, you'll notice that each frame is often missing chunks of the picture, and the, those chunks appear in the next frame. That's just because the frame rate of this screen is lower than the camera, actually. But it still appears solid to the human eye. Here we test some very basic scan line type effects, and my wife wanted to show this to some co-workers, so I threw their, their company's name on there. I got the initials WK, just barely fitted in there, pixels are a little limited.